I had this dress, which was honestly a huge mistake because it was so much lower than I thought it was going to be, but I couldn't, I didn't have time to change it. So I was pulling up my dress all night. I was so uncomfortable because like, I just was like, I do not want a boob to pop out. And you know what it did at the streamer awards after party. I don't remember who came up to me. I think it was Brit. Brit came up to me and was like, girly, I have to come over to you to tell you something. And I was like, oh. and she's like, I saw, you know, boobs out. And I was like, oh. she's like from girl to girl, cover up. And I was like, ah, who else saw? Who else saw? Okay. So a whole while wardrobe malfunction happened. Okay. And I, uh, the only person I know who saw was Brit. Um, but yeah, I mean, I was terrified it was going to happen. I was freaking out all night putting tape. Like there's this thing called fearless tape and you put it on one side of your dress and it sticks to your, you know, and I was just like holding it for dear life. I was like, please, 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 please. Okay. So all I was thinking was about my stupid wardrobe malfunction happening. So that's why I was stressed the whole night. I couldn't even like clap or like raise my arms because it would like pull my dress down. I was like, this is just the worst, but I didn't have another dress. I didn't try on the dress fully before the awards because, um, when I did try them on the clasp was broken, like it came broken. So I had to get it uh, fixed. Like, you know, the hook on a dress or anything that it just was not attached. It was like hanging on by a thread. So it, it, I took it in to get fixed. So I thought in my head when I was trying it on, oh, once this gets fixed, it'll obviously go on fine. So when I tried it on the first time, that clasp wasn't working. And I was like, ah, just get it fixed and everything will be fine. Of course, I put it on two hours before the awards and I'm like, oh no, this is, now I'm going to be uncomfortable all night. I was hoping the tape would save me. I mean, like, I don't feel like I, anyway, so uh, stress the whole night. So then when, of course, Austin comes up to me and, and puts the dang, uh, I've been dodging eye contact with the man all night because... I know if I catch Austin's stupid eyes, he's gonna, he's gonna be like, oh, Foosley. So I was literally looking down whenever he'd come by and then he still did it to me, which is so, it's up behavior of him to do that because I don't want to be on camera. I looked down, I was like, and then I hear my name. I was like, darn it, darn it. Screw you, screw you, screw you. 